Hey, Hi. this is uh, this is Jeffrey. Mm-hmm. Sorry. We are the Walk Offs. We think the Walk Off is the single best moment in all of sports, and we've got a nice little YouTube channel here that celebrates baseball called the Walk Offs. Um, today, this is our third edition, our third mm-hmm. session in our YouTube channel, and today we are going to review some of Henry's best collectible items, anything from baseballs that we scored at games to autos to baseball cards, all the good stuff. So, okay, stuff that happened over the past year. So, first, um, on April thirty first, two thousand sixteen, Minnesota the Twins at were in Oakland. We went to it. We were cheering for the Twins, and this guy got some wristbands. And he was showing up, um, giving them to Twins fans, and I got some. Very cool. Love it. Mm-hmm. Twins win. Same game. Yep. Nope. See if you, you see if you cover up the. See. Win. Twins. Oh, wins. Win. Yeah, nice. Same game. Um, people were giving up necklaces. They you, threw them to the crowd. Why do you think they were doing that? I don't know. I mean, these are kind of Giants colors right here. These black and orange. You know? At, at an A's game. Funny, huh? This is kind of... That's Oakland colors. Oakland's colors, That's yeah. That's gold. Right. Totally I don't know why they're showing those. I don't either. Oh, I don't know why. Why? It's from a different game. Different game. <laughs> So this was from the Twins game. Yeah, this. Twins Oakland game. But then they created the person, the awesome. person in the back. Give okay, the game there it is. All right, got that cleared up. Okay. All right, Next third item. A double play. Ooh, this was a... Joe Mauer. That was a pretty cool one. Oh, okay, hold it up there a little longer so that they can see it. Okay, so this is a game ball. Yep, Stephen Vogt grounded into this double play. Stephen Vogt grounded into a double play. Mm-hmm. And then Maurer caught it, first base, right? Yep. He tossed it into the crowd. Tossed it into the crowd. Dad got it. And then... Mr. Joe Maurer. And we also got a little Joe Maurer. So I'm going to put it back up there for the everybody to see. Pretty cool. We just got a little stand at Bobby's Diamond Sports Cards in San Rafael to put the ball in as well as his card. Another so stand. We got an autograph before the game. I saw him coming down. Miguel Sano. Miguel Sano. So this is pretty cool. We had mm-hmm. seats right above the dugout, yep. and Henry saw him, recognized him, yep. and and uh, gave him a shout out, and said, "Hey, can we have an auto?" Held the ball up, mm-hmm. and we just rolled it down the dugout, and uh, Miguel signed it and sent it back. Guess what his favorite team when he was little? Which was it? Twins. Twins. Really? Yeah. Even though he lived in Dominican Republic. Well, that's pretty like, cool. Yeah, he was in. So, he didn't make her working like the twins. Number three, signed out of Miguel Sano. We're hoping he has a great season this year. Up in you mean next year? Twins land, yep. Minnesota Twins Cup. We got that this summer. Oh, hey, I brought this. It's like my commemorative thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all right. Okay. okay Anything else? Game? Oh, one more from that game. Want to tell that story? We got one more collectible. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. There was a Brian Dozier who made a diving catch in the infield. Yep. But then we gave it away to like a Twins fan who was like six years old. Yeah. Because that was our second ball that we caught. Yeah. Um, and 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 there was a few fans around us. They were like, oh, their second one. And then we talked about it a little bit. And yeah. Quick like, yeah, that was pretty nice. Nice moment. Mm-hmm. That was cool. All right, what's up next? Okay, which one should we do next? Okay. Oh, dealer's choice. You get to you decide. Okay, I'm going to do this, some random baseballs I have. Okay. To the Sporting College World Series. Very cool. From my Uncle Pat. Uncle Pat. Living back in Wisconsin. Thanks, Uncle Pat. Shout out. Um, another one from Wisconsin. My grandma gave this to me. Seems like a regular normal baseball. No. It's got just the only thing that's different is the Brewers logo. Very nice. Next. This I got came from Grandma. Grandma Sue. Yeah. Shout out to Grandma Sue, mm-hmm. also on Scotty. Thank you. And then I got this at Bobby's. It's just a normal baseball. Magic baseball. Very cool. To get signed, but I want to use it just for like stuff. Okay. Okay. Right on. What's next? Next, let's do... we got a stack over here off to the side here. He's selecting from. It's very, very strategic. Very particular. Um, Ace Fest. Ace Fest. All right. So last January... January 24th, 2016. January 24th, 2016. Uh, Henry and I went to our first Ace Fest. Mm-hmm. And um, who's the first guy that you saw when you walked in? I'll be right back. I guess you got grass with him. Oh, okay. <laughs> I guess he forgot one of those uh, items, so he's just going to take a little break. And it's a slam of his door, <laughs> going into his bedroom to figure it out. So Ace Fest was pretty cool. Um, 
it was uh, a full day session. We got there probably about um, an hour before the gates opened, maybe 45 minutes, stood in line and um, Done. and got some uh, autographs. And as we walked in the gate, mm -hmm. there was the first... Um, there was um, three people there. Okay. I got... I didn't take pictures of one. It was Ron Washington, the third base coach. All right. And the other two people were John Axford and Yonder Alonso. I got a picture of those two. Yonder Alonso, that's right. And I got an actual picture, even if it's Stan, Billy Butler, who is... Big was, country breakfast. He's, but he got traded to, he went to New York. Yeah. He did not do that well. No. He only had like four homers with the A's. Mm. Then it was like then he went then he went to the Yankees and it was like third game of the Yankees so it was something like that he had a home run. All right, Billy, want any more Ace Fest yep. items? We got some more, a few more. Awesome. We got, I got some signed batting gloves. Very cool. From Are you gonna use these batting gloves this season? Nope. No. Nope. Are you gonna ever use them again? Oh. Uh, uh, Probably not, huh? No. Just keep them nice. Yeah. All right. What do you got? Max Muncy autographed. Max Muncy. What position does he play? He plays. He's a catcher, isn't he? You no, know, he's a first baseman. First baseman. And some has DH. Okay. First baseman. Who was the other autograph? What? Who was the other autograph? Both. Oh, both were Max Muncy. Yeah. Okay. He autographed both gloves. I forgot about that. Okay. He Very said, cool. He said, "Do you want both gloves?" I forgot about that thing. Okay. Um, I'll get it after. I got two left. I'll do it after them. He's just got, you know, more in his room. Okay, so we got so Billy Butler. So much and we got gloves. And then we got an autograph BB. Autograph baseball. This was, mm -hmm. yeah, this was nice. You want him help opening that up? I don't know how to open this. Yeah. Um, They're good things. Right there on the bottom there. Person. You want to tell the story of this sucker while I uh, get it opened? So it's, um, so his name was like super hard to pronounce. Yeah. Uh, but he said, he said, and his name is Daniel Colon. Number 57. Nice. Sir. Very cool. What what does he do? He's a relief pitcher. Relief pitcher. Very cool. He got his first one that the A's he went to. Yeah, Daniel Cole. Because that's Sean Manning uh, didn't pitch five full innings. Right. Awesome. He went into the fifth inning but left. Okay. What's up next? Oh, this is cool. Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, and Eric Sogard signed baseball. Very cool. And card. Awesome. Show him the whole package dun, there. Dun, dun, dun. We waited in line to see Eric. He didn't play very much this year, did he? He didn't play any. No. Got hurt. Spring training, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah. What yeah. happened to him? Right knee. Right knee. And he, yeah, he's out for Pretty a solid second baseman, though. Yeah, he's really good. Hopefully he's back next year and yep. playing well. All right. So that was the Ace Fest, right? Is there anything yep. else from Ace um, Fest? There we is, did get a really cool picture. Is, I will get it. Oh, one more thing. We did get a pretty cool picture with him and Yonder Alonso um, that I took uh, on my phone. And I think someone else said he just yelled at. Um, I'm not sure why the door slams every time he goes by there. Um, so I'm stretching. I'm uh, delivering um, some in between. So uh, this year has been pretty fun uh, going to baseball parks here in the Bay Area. Um, as well as we hit one uh, back in Minnesota, as well as uh, a day at Miller Park um, in Milwaukee to see the Brewers. So, um, and we also had a wonderful day at uh, Dodger Stadium. So, those are where all of these uh, collections are going to come from. Oh yeah, there's one more thing here from Ace Fest. Dun 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 dun. Okay, it's signed as Josh Fegley. Okay, nice. And Yonder Alonso, and I'm forgetting another thing. Okay, and one more thing. So that's an ace hat right there. So a little story behind this ace hat. So this was Henry's first ace hat that he'd ever had. And um, he uh, he got this. And then after he got this signed, he announced that he was no longer going to wear this hat. So he inherited my ace hat. Um, I like to uh, like to sport all of baseball. So I'm rocking my, rocking my Dodgers, my Dodgers I, I am going to wear it. Hat. Just not school. Oh, not school. Okay. Of course, right. I'm watching the games. Oh, okay. Right on. Okay. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we brought the bat. I got a baseball bat. It's a 26. This is cool. Um, And it's signed with Max Muncy and Yonder Alonso. Oh, just about smacked me in the head there. All right. What do we got? All right. Let's show it for the... Max Muncy yeah. and Yonder Alonso. Very cool. Yonder. Yeah. yeah. This time we'll do... All right. Was that is that all of Ace Fest now? He keeps forgetting stuff. 
That's hilarious. So Ace Fest will uh, also happen here in um, a couple months. It's the middle of November right now, and we're anticipating that Ace Fest will happen um, sometime in January. We did not make it to the Giants um, Festival, um, so we're hoping to maybe do that this year, um, and maybe even Twins Fest. You never know if we're back in Minnesota at any point in time. That'd be kind of fun. Um, so we got a few more items here. It sounds like he's coming back with uh, his, his last. Is this also a uh, Ace Fest item? No. How dare you? Oh, how dare I? How dare you be hiding? Okay. okay. Oh, he's got one more. All right. What's next? What's this the next category? The Brewers game. Brewers game. Okay. You want to tell that story? August, this is August 9th, 2016. Braves. Braves. Brewers. Yeah. Um, I'm not going to tell you the score. Go look at yourself. <laughs> um, so there. this is a ball. It's not a foul ball. It was a fly out. Yeah. Michael Boyzik pitched it to Gordon Beckham. He hit the center fielder Keon Broxton. He caught it. He threw it to Erdon Perez, the second baseman. Then he hit, threw it to my dad. Yeah. Who bobbled it. I did bobble it. It was right. Boom, boom, and then, and then like, I got it. And there was a really tall girl who almost got it. She did. She just about got it. Mm-hmm. I was so glad I got it though. Mm-hmm. We were we had uh, we were behind the Brewers dugout. We were like in the fourth like, fourth row, like maybe? fifth row, maybe. Like, Fifth or sixth? Something yeah, like that. Yeah, like six rows behind the few, dugout. A few rows behind the dugout. Here, let's put it over here. So this was a Brewers Brewers game ball. That was pretty cool. And now we got Brewers star shortstop. Uh, soon to be a star. Called up on August 2nd, 2016. This was a pretty cool mm-hmm. um, little moment. You should you tell him. You want me to tell you? Okay, yeah. so Henry was it was before the game. Before the game, right? Yeah, uh, yep. before the game, and there was probably about four or five kids that were sitting around above yeah, the dugout. Yeah, who, who were like in their teens. Yeah, and they were tall, and I have this picture of it. Um, I should have had that like teed 13, up. But, 15, 13, 14. 15. And probably a foot taller than Henry. And they, yeah. they walked up, Henry standing there, and they walked up on both sides of him. Yeah, I was in the middle. Yeah, and he literally like looked at these two boys, and then he, he kind of turned around and looked back at me like, what's going on? And then more and more kids started populating, and he had his pen and his ball ready to go, and a bunch of people were signing, and um, he was kind of going down the row, and Arcia picked Henry out and pointed to him and threw the ball up to him. Orlando Arcia. And uh, it didn't get to him the first time, and then he did it again, and he pointed to Henry to make sure that it was, it was him that got the ball. Um, so just a shout out to Orlando Arcia. Um, recognize that Henry been waiting there. Um, bigger kids were in line. Brother with he... brother with Oswald Arcia. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. Former twin. Yep. Now he's he former got, A. He got... No. No. He had traded to the Rays. Oh. So that's what you're Okay. Yeah. And then he got and then he got traded from the Rays to the Padres. Okay, that's, that's, right. that's right. That's right. Right. So. Thanks, Oswaldo. That was our first uh, opportunity to go see um, Miller Park in Milwaukee. So that was fun. Got a game ball and a signed ball by Oswaldo Arcia. Now, um, what's gonna, next? Just going to do so something. So some, something. Okay. Make something there. That oh, that's us. pretty cool. Yeah. Um, it was for an auction, and I wanted it. So mom brought it to the auction, and then she did it, and luckily got it on Madison Bumgarner. Very cool. Yep. So. Oh God! I just noticed this. Mm. Natural sports, five thousand nine hundred seventeen of six thousand. Oh, very cool. I've never, I, ne- I didn't even notice that. Yeah. Right on. So it's a numbered, numbered product. This is the first. I'll, I'll hold it while you. This hold is the up first the thing of what of, of mine, like bobblehead or something like that. First. So first. this was at a school fundraiser. His mom was a chair of the. Event. Because she's a, the, the um what's the. It's, the the PTA vice president. Yeah, so she uh, she helped with that event and and, and here he's got the World Series trophies of 2010. Right on. Yeah. 2012. I've already got the he got like the the 12 outs or something like that. Yeah. He pitched, he pitched and the 2014. His hair is pretty short here. And the funny thing is usually what would I say when I see him? Get it. Get a haircut. Yeah. I okay. <laughs> Same with Brendan Crawford. So that's pretty cool. And the cool thing, the weird thing about the world, the Giants, when there are three World Series they won, they were all on the road. In Texas versus the Rangers. Oops. Dropping some knowledge right now. Yes. In Detroit. Yeah. Against the Tigers. In Kansas City. Um, also known as Kansas City, Missouri, not Kansas um, gets the rules, yeah. Yeah. 
Okay. Now we're going to do right, what's next? My, my birthday game. Okay. Let's set this up. Um, I don't, I also have another ball, mm -hmm. but it's somewhere. Okay. Um, Billy Burns autographed. So this was your birthday. Yep, when they absolutely annihilated the Rangers 14-6. Right, right. New drivers were supposed to pitch, then he got on the DL store. Caesar Rasmus. If you say, who the heck is him? Yeah, right, he's a, he gave up so many runs. Yeah, he got rocked, didn't he? Uh -huh. Yeah. And it was also game, I think it was game five of the NBA Finals. It was going on right next door because it was June 13th, right? Uh -huh. So, um, and so the stands were pretty empty at the Coliseum. Um, and we were sitting on the A's side above the dugout. Pretty much the only people who were there were just like people who just wanted to watch the game right. and season ticket orders. Yeah. And then like we met this guy who was a season ticket order. Season ticket order? Yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah. He was like in his 20s. Right. And, season ticket order. and then the at the like the sixth inning, what happened? Sixth or seventh um, inning. Remember what happened? That rapper came. Yeah, what's his name? E40. The E40 came yeah. with a bunch of buddies. Yeah, he's, he was sitting in a, uh, the row in front of us, right right yeah, on the, the dugout. Buddy, yeah, like right, he were, we were in the front row. Then, yeah. he, like, let's say we were, like, right here. Yeah. Right here. That was, and, and then uh, he was sitting right there. Yeah, well, how was that experience? Buddies. And then he, like, started, like, swearing. Yeah, something. he was a piece of work. And he, none of them were even paying attention to the game. Right. His wife kicked over my soda, too. Really? Yep. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> baseball fun. Nobody was paying attention to the game. Yeah, they were. They were just like yak 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 yak. They yuck, totally yuck. were. They totally were. But that was a good night, right? You got yep. to see a Next, lot of runs. Um, the Giants game on right. um, August fourteenth, two thousand fifteen. Um, necklaces. There we go. Yeah, August fourteenth, two thousand fifteen. They um beat the Nationals eight to five. Right on. Okay. I saw four home runs. Matt Duffy for the Giants, Hunter Pence for the Giants, Danny Espinosa for the Nationals, and Bryce Harper for the Nationals. And the Nationals, Bryce Harper, which is 30th of the year. Right on. And that's when you and a mom and I and E went, right? <clears throat> you sat in the bleachers? Yeah, we all went. What do you say? <laughs> yeah, right. Okay. All right. What's next, bud? The, the Twins game. In? Um, Minnesota. Right on. Okay. This so... was... This summer. This, this was September. Oh. No, 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 no. August. Oh uh, yeah. Fourteenth. August fourteenth. All right. And who'd you yeah. go with? Um, my my buddy Braden. Right. Wait. Shout out to Braden. I think this and is Chris actually. I think this Minnesota. is actually from Oakland, actually. Oh, okay. Yeah, this one's from Oakland. All right. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna wait. Whoopsie daisies. Whoopsie daisy. Yep. One moment, please. Put that Minnesota game on hold. Mm -hmm. This is. Uh, I got some autographs. Michael Topkin. Oh, that's right. We got this. Ball. We got this yeah. sign when we were at the uh, A's Twins Brandon game. Kinsler. I don't think you recognize that as, as the same person. Okay. Um. Then this is. Okay, I'm going. Uh, not right now. Okay. Um, number forty-nine. Put down in the comments. Put down in the comments if you know number number forty-nine. The Twins. Oh yeah, okay. I can't um, remember his name. All right. I don't know his name. I forgot his name. Again. Is that the guy you got right at the end there when you went down? And snuck down there? No. No? He's number eight. Okay. And do you have the card that you got signed uh, at this yes. game? Yes. Um, it's in here. Okay. The card pile. Also. Okay. All right. Now it's the Twins game. Oh, okay. That one buddy got the Twins ball. Right on. DC. Um, it's got Ryan Presley on the top and Brandon Kinsler on the bottom. And, and this was August 14th, 2016. At Target Field. Unfortunately, they, they got annihilated. 11, they got rocked. 11 4. Yeah. Always saw Dodgers 101th career home run. That was a fun day, though. You went with your buddy, your buddy Braden, mm -hmm. and his dad, Chris, and me, and Henry. It was fun. Fun afternoon. All right, what's next? Um, The Dodger game. Okay. So this Actually, is pretty no, special. No, 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 no. Save that for last. Save that for last? Okay. All okay, right. now we can do the cards. Okay. So it'll run on cards. Why don't you just roll through these? I don't think you need to take them yeah. out of the sleeve. Okay. And just Adrian show Beltre. Okay. And these were hits that you just got throughout the year that you're just yeah. happy with. Christian Walker. Very nice. Okay. Um, Richard. Very cool. Josh Reddick. Josh Reddick. This is actually from the Ace Fist. One of our faves. It's from the Ace Fist, I think. Yeah. Yeah, this is. Yeah, that's, oh yeah, we bought it from that it was, uh, it was a card big, dealer. Yeah, it was a big, it was a big, it was like a big like area. Yeah. And there's a bunch of cards. Yeah. Ricky Nicolino. Oh, a stack. Yeah. If you have a story about where you got the card, tell it. 
Just um, by chance. Calvin Jr. Jr. is good. Where'd you get that? Um, Bobby's. Bobby's. Bought a pack. Okay. Like a person, like, like, so he said to do like, a, people, some people said to do like a certain thing, like do like one, two, and three. Right. Because there's three rows. Yep. And I just did like the first three rows and I got that. Cool. Something like that. All right. Corey Seager, double. Very cool. It's like, um, each card is $24, I think. Yeah, each dollar was $24. Each pack? No, dollar. Oh. The card. Each card was $24. So, so together it's 48 mm -hmm. Just that thing. Peter O'Brien autograph. Special abilities. He's my favorite. Dimeback. All right. Oh, I see what you were saying, that some of these sold on eBay for $24. Yeah. Okay, got it. I wasn't following you there for a second, but Kurt I got Suzuki. it now. This is actually a different card. So this is what happens. We were unpacking, me and my friend Juan were unpacking cards, and he got that. Then it was for Christmas. He gave it to me. And then I brought it to the game, and voila. Yeah, we got this signed. Henry got this signed at the Twins game when the Twins were in town to play the A's. Yeah, and he was like one, he was probably the last twin to leave the field. Yeah. He was chatting with somebody. Yep. Oh, but here's a really cool one. Babe Ruth, original Yankee Stadium seat, four or five. Very cool. This is the Babe Ruth Leaf set. Nice. Where'd you I get got that? It for my birthday from my friend Sam and Andrew. Shout out to They're, the twins. Yep. Thanks, guys. It's been nice. Um, it's, a, it's, it's a seat. Very cool. My buddy Josh thinks this is my best car, but it's not. <laughs> All right, I'm take it out. Yeah, you can just hold it up. Brendan Crawford, rookie, on-card autograph, 94 of 999. And where'd you get that? Um... Christmas? Yeah. Christmas. That was also um, bought at Bobby's. I got this from a YouTuber for his name. It's a like, it's like a booklet, you know those booklets you can get. Um you can get a booklet. Yeah. And then I just made it can make your own. Top sixteen series one. Oliver Press and Austria Vacura booklet one of one. Very cool. I made it myself. Oh, nice. So this is what you do. A homemade you take, version. You take um two make make get tuck up. Cut out two cards. Yeah. But things, papers. Make sure they're bigger than the card. Glue, glue the card or the sleeve. I did. Sleeve. Why don't you show it to them so they can see I it? You're kind of talking off. Okay. There you go. I did the sleeve. Yeah. Because I didn't want to ruin the card. Yep. And then um, you just put a card in there. Then you tape them together. And voila. Voila. All right. And then I think this is my best card. I got it for my Christmas or birthday. birthday uh, yeah, birthday. Yep. Byron Buxton. Nine hundred sixty-five for three ninety-nine. Two thousand thirteen Bowman Platinum Prospect Autographs Green Refractor. Show that. Too. Nine point five Gem Mint, and that's it was from Bobby's. Very cool. Uh huh. Very cool. Yeah, Byron Buxton. We're big Last, fans of Buxton. We're hopeful he's going to be good this year. Last yep. but not least. Okay, this was probably my favorite mm. item you got all year. Oh, there's Buxton. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> Byron, have a great year this next coming year. We're he, crossing our fingers he, for you. Uh, Ten home runs this year. Yeah, he he had a he struggled a little bit. Yeah, but in then the beginning he, he was in the minors, then he got called up. Right, he went back down. Like during September, he did really good. Right, right. So this right. is uh, so what you you tell the story? You want me to tell the story? Yeah. Okay. Um. Okay, so my dad was a big Dodger fan. I grew up uh, watching a lot of Dodger baseball because he was a big Dodger fan. So we went to um, L.A. this summer uh, for spring break. We, we live up in the Bay Area, and we took in a Dodgers game. And we got there before the stadium opened, and um, we, were the, we were first in line, so we were pretty excited to get in. We got commemorative jerseys because it was Jackie Robinson Day that day. Yep. So each one of us got a Jackie Robinson jersey. Um, and then we got in, and you also got a little um, Dodger little baseball bat. Right? A little blue one? Yeah. And then we had some Dodger Dogs, right? Yeah, um, I had two. They're, they're, they're so good. <laughs> you did have a couple. And I think the Dodger we, Dog we, is the best we dog were, in baseball. We were with my... Um, Your friend Gus. Yeah, Gus. Yeah. Yeah. yeah th no, I think it's the, not the best hot dog in, in baseball. You don't think it's the best hot dog in baseball? Be best food. Best baseball. food in baseball. Okay, so let's be clear, huh? All right, so cool. So we were there. Um, with your buddy Gus and his dad, um, and we just had a really great time. Mm -hmm. And there was a guy sitting in front of us who uh, had a backpack with him. Oh, you got a comment? 
Oh, what? See his name. Oh, well, I'll, t- I'll say his name in a second. So, um, so he was sitting there, and probably about the, f- yeah, about the fourth or fifth inning, I forget exactly what inning it was, um, the, the Dodgers were winning, and Henry was having a great time. He's jumping up and down. And the guy um, basically turned around and said to me, he said, hey, will you watch my backpack? We stop <laughs> We watch. We watch my backpack while um, I run run up or run upstairs for a second. I said sure, and he comes back and he and he holds this baseball. He turns it around. He said, "I think it's. I, I know it's Henry's first game because he met him, said hello, found out it was his first game." And he said, "I think every kid should have a baseball at every first game. So if he doesn't catch one, if it's okay with you, I'm going to turn around and give this to him at the end of the game." And so at the end of the game, he he did that. He turned around and and presented it to him. And um, we were, when we were there, we were kind of, you know, thinking about my dad, um, who's no longer with us, and um, kind of gave him the, you know, the three dub, the W's. His name was Wayne. And um, it was so kind of... That's what middle name is. Yeah, and that's, and Henry's middle name is Henry Wayne, and my name is Jeffrey Bryan, and my dad's name was Wayne Jeffrey. And when we introduced this guy, us, ourselves to this guy, um, we found out that his name was also <laughs> Jeffrey. So a little sign Who's from... He's a season ticket holder. He's a season ticket holder. Uh, has a wonderful collection. It was just a wonderful gift. Yeah, and he has a lot. He has a backpack full of like auctions. He did. He went down and, and, and bought guess, the ball. And guess what kind of ball this is? At the auction. It was a Jack Peterson home run ball off Will Smith of the Brewers. In 2015 mm-hmm. season. So pretty special. I bet it, was, it went to center. Yeah, it was a pretty special um, collectible and a pretty special Dad day. doesn't think it is. Well, we looked it up, um, and now we don't have the sticker on it anymore no. to, re- to to look it up anymore. So, um, but I remember it, we it was Jack Peterson ball said, for sure. And you're like, no, like Jack Peterson home run ball, Will <laughs> Smith against the awful Smith of Bruce. Yeah. So this is DNA on it. That's I bet cool. I bet it was used for like other stuff just to get the home run. Maybe. Yeah, maybe like some ground out. At the end of the day, I don't really care how we hit it. I just think it was really neat moment for us to experience at the Dodger game. So, all right. I think that's it, right? Just, so, lots just, of stuff. I just want to show, I just want to be, get my Dodger match. Oh, okay. Yeah. At the I'm Dodger sure. game, he was able to wear, oh, I should also say that um, he wore a Jack Peterson jersey to the game and to get a Jack Peterson ball from a guy named Jeffrey um, was just kind of cool all the way around uh, and just a, just a special moment to hang out. I think that's one of the best things about sports and about baseball and this little journey that Henry's on watching baseball and loving it is just being able to spend time with him. And so if there's dads out there, um, yeah, that's, that's one thing that we certainly cherish and, and love. And these collectible items are cool, but the moments that we, um, I guess, get to partake in because of, of the games are, are, are the special part. So he's got a pretty cool little blue bat that he plays with constantly um, that he picked up at the game that I think he wants to come back and, and show everybody. Oh, right on. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You want me to hold it? Okay. Here's There's the bat. The bat. That's nice. Also, the, so this is the Dodgers bring, bat that we got at the game. Didn't just bring the bat. You didn't just bring the bat. You also brought the... Jackie and, Robertson. Oh, it, yeah. it was only so large, unfortunately. Oh, yeah. It was, it was just the big sizes. Yeah. Good so it was Jackie that. Robinson Day that day, number 42. So and that was pretty cool. here's the Peterson jersey I was wearing. Oh, yeah. That's right. <laughs> You're bringing it all out. Very cool. Peterson. Peterson. All right. Well... Thanks, everybody, for joining us. Uh, this was the... Uh, like and subscribe down below. Why don't you kind of come in here, bud? Like, comment, subscribe. Oh, like, comment, and subscribe down below. We're, uh, we're enjoying doing this, and um, thanks, everybody, for spending time with us. Have a great day. I'm Jeffrey. This is Henry. We're the Lock Us. Next See- video is going to be a Cleveland Indians binder video. Cleveland Indians binder video, video celebrating the 2016... World Series. Next, team. we're gonna go like Dodgers and like, and then the like the Blue Jays. Right on. Everybody, have a good day. <clears throat>